Welcome to Fun with Drilling Engineering. In drilling engineering, a lot of effort is taken to avoid any pollution to the environment. Therefore, here in Germany, the rig is erected in the middle of a specially designed drill site, about 100 by 100 meters, as you can see here. The entire area is waterproof to prevent any seepage of fluids into the soil. The drill site is constructed in such a way that it has slight slope in the direction of the middle point under the drilling rig. And at its lowest point under the drilling rig, we find the hole called the drill cellar. Any liquid which drops on the drill site, such as rainwater or any potential water contaminated with oil or grease, will accumulate in the cellar and will have to be pumped out from time to time. Before this drill fluids from the cellar are disposed, they need to be processed and cleaned. And this is done on the drill site by using um, a so-called three-chamber separator. Behind me, we can see a sketch of the such a three-chamber separator. In the first chamber, the liquid goes in from one side at the top and leaves at the top of the other side. The chamber is large enough to allow heavy and big side solids like sand and stones to sink downwards and settle on the ground gradually. The liquid then moves into the second chamber from the top and leaves at the bottom. Everything lighter than water such as oil or grease will stay at the top of the chamber as those components will tend to swim on top of the water and will not flow downwards to the bottom. The separation process is supported by a pack of coke in the second chamber. It is a kind of coal. The coke is a material that is very porous and due to its extremely large surface, it absorbs suspended particles of oil and grease at its huge surface. In the third chamber, the water comes to a final rest. Here we can take samples for examination in the laboratory. When the water leaves the separator at the top of the third chamber, we can consider it cleaned. The pressing in the three chamber separator works pretty well, and we can demonstrate that in our experiment here. We build the three chamber separator with three cups and a pair of straws. Now we need a dirty mixture for our experiment. We have put together water, cooking oil, a bit of sand, and pepper as suspended particles, and we have mixed them together as good as possible. Now let's see if we can get this mixture processed. We see here that the first chamber works very well. As you can see, gradually the sand is removed in the first chamber. In the second chamber, in between all these glass marbles, the oil and the pepper is retained. And in the third chamber, you can see the clear water left. Cheers! It looks very tasty from here. If you want more details on how we protect the environment while drilling, come to our lecture, Machines and Equipment of Drilling Engineering. We look forward to see you here. Cook off.